Hello, welcome to Liverpool FC News Today channel. Continued their Premier League title defence with a comfortable 4,0 win over Wolves at Anfield. The Reds were cheered on by 2,000 fans as supporters returned to the Cop for the first time since the club became English champions. The Reds got off to a brilliant start as Henderson played a delightful ball over the top for Salah to run onto. Connor Cody got to it first but failed to clear it, opting to chest the ball down instead, with Salah lurking just behind and ready to take advantage. The Egyptian ace slotted home from close range to give the Reds the lead after just 24 minutes of the game. The Reds had a brief scare just before the internal when Connor Cody went down inside the area after running past Sadio Main. VAR intervened after Craig Pawson initially pointed to the spot and the decision was overturned. Liverpool were comfortable in the game and dominated the majority of possession. They doubled their advantage in the second half through Jorginho Wijnaldum, who picked up the ball midway through the Wolves' half before curling the ball into the top corner from the edge of the box. The game was finished off for good with 20 minutes to play when Salah curled in a tempting cross which Joel Matip comfortably converted with a close range header. Liverpool kept pushing the ball forward and Sadio Main put the game to bed by forcing home the Reds' fourth. The ball went in off Nelson Semedo under pressure from Main. The result leaves Liverpool within touching distance of the top, and will go into next weekend's game with table, top as Tottenham knowing they can leapfrog Jose Marinho's side with a draw. Tottenham beat Arsenal earlier on Sunday in the first North London derby of the season. They are currently ahead of Liverpool by five goals going into next weekend's tie. Didn't have an awful lot to do thanks to Liverpool's dominance, but was vocal and commanded the box well when needed. Was a constant threat down the left flank and played some nice balls through to Sadio Main. He was a bundle of energy and didn't look like a player who was making his 20th appearance this season already for club and country. A strong showing from Matip, and deserved to get himself on the score sheet. The centre back looked like had formed a strong partnership with Fabinho. Like Matip, Fabinho had a good game and kept the Wolves' attack quiet. He always looked for a forward pass whenever he received the ball and was crucial in Liverpool's build up play. Started the game slightly slowly, and was perhaps taken aback by the atmosphere of having fans back on the cop for the first time. But he had a solid showing before being taken off for Trent Alexander, Arnold in the second half. Capped off a fine performance with a beautiful goal. Did well to outwork the Wolves midfield and create chances going forward. Dominated the middle of midfield along with Wijnaldum and didn't let anything get past him. A great performance from the youngster, who played like an experienced veteran at times. His decision making was top class. A constant threat down the right, and knew when to slow the pace down late in the match rather than risk losing the ball. A few nice touches and flicks to go with his performance. Had a few good chances in the opening 45, but was quiet in the second period before being taken off. Like Robertson, Maine was a constant source of energy and linked up well with the Scotsman. Maine rarely lost the ball throughout the game and created a few decent chances for his fellow forwards. Capped off his performance with the fourth goal of the game, with the help of Nelson Semedo. Looked fairly lively against his old club. But with only half an hour on the pitch there wasn't too much time for him to make a difference. He came on when the game was already won, and Jota looked in cruise control really. Kept possession well, but didn't have an awful lot to do after coming on for Williams with half an hour to play. Will be encouraging for Liverpool fans to see him back after his hamstring injury. Came on with 10 minutes to play as Jurgen Klopp opted to rest Henderson and did what was required of him. 